Hi, welcome back to Dubai Real Estate Philosophy. My name is Ahmed and in this video we're talking about a very very unique iconic project in Dubai which is great for investment. So in this video we're going to be talking about the heart of Europe. Now a lot of people they haven't heard of the heart of Europe even a lot of brokers they're not really familiar with what this project is. So the heart of Europe is this very unique lifestyle destination. It is mainly in the world islands for those of you who know the world islands these were made long long time back. Of course there was a huge pause in the middle because of course the 2008 financial crisis was here so the world wasn't investing as much money into real estate but it's been a long time since and these islands are there and a lot of development that is going on. So the heart of Europe we're going to do a quick presentation on the heart of Europe it mainly it consists of hotel style living it's great for investors there are a couple of investment options which we'll go over now here looking at the presentation of course you can see the heart of Europe it's centered around the ocean now again we made this video for those of you who haven't watched that video why you should be investing the way as you can see in the presentation you know there's ease of business 100% foreign ownership you can have of course it's the you know, one of the safest countries in the world it's very strategically located of course you can have an opportunity to get a golden visa for yourself so you can have a permanent and residents of course there's no taxation as well on personal income moving on to now this entire project the heart of europe is being led by klein dines group which is the largest european real estate company in dubai so as you can see they've been operating in dubai since 1985 they have a huge portfolio they've won a lot of awards so there's a very trusted developer who has bought up this iconic development you know which is also part of the tourism plan of dubai to ensure that they keep increasing tourism and keep bringing unique ideas in Dubai where people can invest and tourists can come and have a great time. Now moving on in this picture you can see where the world islands are so you know we're still talking you know somewhere close to the Palm of course the Jumeirah Islands are there so basically you can go to near uh, Jumeirah Beach there's a shipyard over there and you can take a boat directly to the heart of Europe. This heart of Europe consists of six islands and over here you can see the island location it's basically the island of France, Germany, Italy and a couple of others that they have in Sweden also that they have combined together and made this entire thing. I believe there are six islands which we'll go into more detail. Now over here you can see a view of the six islands that they do have very unique place very iconic area again a lot of it is ready as well so you can physically go and see it out we'll see in the video as you can see right now these are some of the shots of uh you know the places they do have they have a raining area an area where there's snow just like in france moving on you can see the entire six islands that they have they have the portofino hotel there they have the main european island we have switzerland sweden germany Cote d'azur okay that is there as well but these are all hotels and they are massive Moving on, you can see the sizes of all the islands. We're looking at almost 2.3 million square foot for main Europe. And then consecutively, we're looking at around 600,000 square feet for Germany, uh, you know, Sweden, you know, relatively same sizes, similar sizes as well. So the total area, the land area that these guys have, we're looking at over around 6 million square feet approximately of development that is going on over here. Now, looking into this with like a bird's eye view, this is a master plan of the community, the heart shape. We have Honeymoon Island. We have the Sweden Boutique Hotel. We have the Cannes Hotel. We have the St. Tropez Hotel. It is a hotel. All these things that are basically coming, each hotel unique with its destination. It's a very, very unique concept. And again, all these things are ready, as you can see in the video uh, right now, people are living there. These hotels are already operational. Now, moving on to some of the fun amenities, they do have a Coral Research Institute over there. They have a tropical rainforest, believe it or not. Uh, they have a raining street, as I mentioned, the snow street. Of course, they're surrounded by beaches, and you can see it's a very well designed, well connected area. You have space for marina and all these things. Again, as I mentioned, these are the six islands. So, we're looking at this project as total estimated value. We're looking at almost five billion dollars worth of investment and development that is going to ensure that this place stays an iconic destination for tourists and is a great return on investment for the investors which we'll get to shortly and we'll talk about the numbers as you can see we have a lot of design when it comes to this area where we're talking about water sports you know gourmet dining they have cultural events it's a very happening area a very very tourist friendly area a lot of tourists who do come especially from Europe as it's meant to be after them they can have that experience there so as you can see the Cote d'Azur again very fun vibrant color buildings these are already people are already living there the hotels are operational the Monaco Hotel very famous if you go on social media there's a lot of videos there's a lot of crazy parties happening over there a lot of events that are already happening over there very very you know, happening area of course they also have the floating seahorse a lot of you might have seen the viral video by uh, Mr. Anas himself who keeps you know making all these viral videos and of you know very high-end areas he already did a review I believe of the seahorse it's a very crazy concept where you can buy a house that is floating you have a even the basement part which is underwater uh, believe it or not you can go check out his video for an in-depth tour of that house as well 
these are available for sale and are part of this project as well they are called this floating seahorse so this is a side view of the floating seahorse as i mentioned you know you have an underwater platform with a seabed you know it's a very crazy idea you can imagine that airbnb it'll be a very very unique property to rent out and no doubt that investors can make a very high high roi with something that's so iconic and unique especially in this Dubai where we have so many options for real estate. So, and of course, they will also be having an SPS station or a smart police station. One of these seahorses, as you can see in this picture, they have a sea boat, they have all these things so you can ensure that the government is there, the law is there, it is a very safe place, it is a very controlled area, there's nothing wild going on, we don't have anything, again, Dubai being one of the safest cities, the government being one of the smartest governments there are, they are ensuring that everything and public safety is, of course, number one. This is the Sweden Island. Sweden Island is a bit different, they have big bungalows over there instead of like a residential hotels we're looking at you know panoramic glass roofs all these things they're a bit more you know they're designed in the swedish viking you know vessel turned upside down type architecture as you can see they're all seven bedrooms they could be let out as well they could be bought as well so it's a very varied mix as i mentioned we have hotel suites that we'll be talking about again we'll be getting into the numbers in a bit over here we also of course have the seahorse and now we have this sweden thing so it is an amazing variety of different uh you know styles of properties so now this is the first option now let's get into the numbers you've seen the ideas the video of the project is very cool everything now we get down to the numbers so what hard to europe is promising is something that's very very unique in the market right so option number one is that they're giving you an roi of 8.33 percent for 12 years right now what that basically means is that an average studio price right now that's available is around 1.6 million right again these are all hotel apartments so you don't have to do anything all you have to do is purchase this hotel apartment and the heart of europe will be running it for you now according to them you know the, uh, this plus of course you have four uh, percent dld and you have you know some fat that's all you have to pay of course for anyway so according to the picture you're making roughly around 133,280 dirhams a year okay and that they will basically guarantee it to you for 12 years so you just put in your money you have 12 8.33 percent coming up to you for 12 years the rest of the money that the roi makes that's what heart of europe keeps and you'll be keeping this it's a very safe investment very sound investment this is what they're giving you as guaranteed you put in 1.6 million they'll give you 8.33 percent for 12 years and then after that it'll be basically a different contract which we can get into more details right uh that is option number one now if we look at option number two another option they're doing is that it's 8.33 percent for 12 years plus a buyback guarantee so what they will do is basically it'll be the same you buy the apartment let's say for 1.6 million studio they will give you 8.33 percent for 12 years and then they will buy it back from you for 3.2 million dirhams which is a 200 percent capital appreciation in 12 years so you are not only you're going to put in 1.6 million you'll be making 8.33 percent return on your investment for 12 years and then after you make all that turn on your investment you get heart of europe will buy it back from you at 3.2 million dirhams guaranteed so this is option number two which is you know fairly unique and then we can go to option number three which is a 60 40 rent pool in this they don't guarantee anything they will basically be giving you according to the occupancy now of course some investors they will say that this is a much more better option because it's a higher risk option but then of course you kind of get higher reward as well if we're doing an amazing season the markets are great you might have a potential to make more right but if you want that guaranteed income you can look at those things now these this was just a quick overview of the three options that they are providing this is something that is very unique it has been going on for quite a while been waiting for you know more details to come for this kind of project to get more known in the market a lot of people are not aware of this but now they have established it there are a lot of investors who have invested money now they're getting return on their investments of course the seahorse if you look at the you know prices here as well you can see the hotel units we're looking at 1.8 million one beds over there if you want to buy for yourself like not hotel starting from around 6.2 million uh, of course we have the floating seahorse amazing unique style that's around 21 million and then of course we have the sweden palaces and the german houses as well which are much much more higher we're looking at around 25 million all the way up to 125 million for the sweden palace so again this is just a quick overview for the heart of europe if you're interested you can let me know we can get on a boat we can go all the way to the heart of europe see it for yourself make sure you know we meet with the experts of heart of europe so they can even guide you even further go physically visit the island this is just a fun iconic unique property in this you know vast options that we have in dubai this is something that you know really stands out it's a cool fun idea which i believe is great for investors fun always attracts tourists so it is not really something that's for residential purposes this is a purely commercial purely investment race well unless you want to buy the sweden palace or the you know seahorse for yourself that's great but most people will be looking at this project for investment if you have any questions feel free to let me know thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you in the next one
but bye for now. And you can conveniently reach out to me directly on my WhatsApp by scanning the QR code at the top right corner.